Most of the power plays in the NHL, any league, what, 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 is the, what is the number one option in the power play? Anybody? Shoot the puck from the point. Most of the goals in the NHL are scored off of shots from the point. Langenbrenner with a shot, he scores! Why? You shoot the pucks from the point, puts the other team in disarray, you got traffic guys in front of that, goals are scored. When you shoot the puck in the power play early, it'll set up all the other plays because you get teams scrambling and then you can open them up and set up plays. So we're going to go over three different segments of power play today. We're going to go over the breakouts, entry into the zone, and set up as well. Breaking the puck out, you're going to have to sometimes ad lib, uh, but this is a control breakout situation uh, where both the D and center need to curl deep into the corner at the same time. So we're going to skate deep into the corner. And the key for timing the drill is making sure that our defenseman steps out at the right time, not too far behind and certainly not ahead of the guys that are curling. The other one you'll see with the center curling behind the net, be a little bit different. We've seen this happen before, smart teams. The center's coming behind the net. As soon as the guy gets here, this guy's gonna jump, okay? And it can be a very dangerous situation. So you need to make sure that you have an option to just dump the pass off to the D. Or you see the center coming and the guy's standing on this side, you tell him, don't take the puck. And then you do the same thing, just break out up the middle and these guys go. And when we do carry the puck in the zone, we want to carry the puck in the zone. Try to get the soft areas, use behind the net where they're not going to force you set up on the half boards on the side, settle things down, set your power play up. You need to dump the puck where you can recover the puck. And the more we can get two guys in the puck to recover the puck, so uh, you're going to be successful in the power play. 90% of the, the uh, power plays in the NHL, they shoot the puck from the point. By shooting the puck at the point, that creates opportunities, allows you to make those plays down low. Uh, and quite often, you'll see the shots come from the middle of the ice and shooting the puck from the middle of the ice. And they do that, they shoot that from the middle of the ice because it really keeps the puck in this area here if it's a shot that's missed the net or a goaltender makes a save. The shots come from the side, shots can miss the net, they end up out of the zone. If you guys watch the Devils a lot, I've seen this umpteen times. You know those two guys, right? Zach Parisi, Patrick Elwell. Saw this last week. They're just playing catch. So they'll work the puck so that, you know, Zach's got some time and space. He comes up here with a left hand shot. Patrick's a left hand shot. He'll start in here. He slides out there. Steps. Fires a shot pass. Tip. In front, score! Deflection! Patrick Elias! It works. You guys got any questions so far? It's pretty simple, right? Easier said than done. 